everybody welcome back to my channel so I have something a little bit different for you guys today so we're gonna do a closing haul or rather just my favorite pickups of 2022 so let's get into it okay so we're gonna start with clothing first because that's probably the shortest category since I didn't pick up that many clothes this year or last year but um, definitely found some good stuff so just get this out the way first my favorite place to shop is the real real um, I probably got 90% of everything but to show you guys here from there but we're gonna start with bottoms first because I think that's what I pick up the most this year so starting off we have this really interesting cool skirt it's from Kith um, you can see on the back there you go you can see but it's my favorite color um it's super cute on this is really interesting hemline at the bottom um front and back and a cute design but i love this skirt it's really stretchy super comfortable and super unique so i thought it was a really cool pickup and it wasn't even that expensive i think it was maybe like 60 bucks on the real real so great place to shop if you want something interesting and maybe even um higher end but for way less so great pick up there and this was definitely the year of skirts um, cargo skirts pleated skirts any type of skirt design you probably saw that was a lot it was very probably very, very trendy so I did pick up um, quite a few skirts this year or last year I keep saying this year 2022 um, another real, real pickup was this um, sporty Fendi skirt. I actually picked this up um, when I went to New York in Soho. So I actually went to the rural store location in Soho and they had this um, definitely cheaper than if I would have got it retail. So um, super cool, super cute. Um, really sporty. I haven't been able to wear it much because right when I got it, I think I got it like right before it started to get cold. So I didn't get too much wear out of it yet. But definitely um, this summer, this spring, I'm going to definitely wearing this more because I love this skirt as well and next um last skirt I think in this um haul or in this segment but I got this um unique glow skirt it's um pleated it's a little bit different so it wasn't a cargo skirt um but definitely cute definitely different for me it's out of my comfort zone but that was kind of something I was trying to get into more um being a little bit out of my comfort zone trying different things different styles so kind of schoolgirl, kind of preppy but um definitely versatile so I really like this one as well and just kidding actually my um favorite skirt or favorite pickup um by far was this diesel cargo skirt so let me zip it up for you it has so many pockets so many compartments so many zippers but it's like super super versatile wear um i'm sure you've probably seen this all over tiktok but um i first saw it um, on instagram and i was like oh my god i had to have it so i picked it up um it zips all the way down um there's a zipper down here and a zipper up here so you can kind of um zip it however you want to um there's drawstrings at the bottom so you can kind of tie it off if you want to make it more cinched at the knee or at the ankle i mean but it's definitely my favorite pickup or favorite clothing item pickup of 2022 by far so um definitely not cheap i didn't get this off the roll i got this off of farfetch so it was pretty much full price um so it was expensive but i think it was definitely worth it i know it's a trendier piece but i'm definitely gonna still keep wearing it because i just think it's cute and it really fits into my personal style and it's unique and every time i wear it i get compliments on it so it's definitely not going out of style at least not for me for quite some time so yeah the last bottom that i got um this was actually off the road as well um these are some kind of like a pleated I don't know what to call them. They're like capris, but they're, I guess they're shorts. They were, they were advertised as shorts on the website, but they're kind of like a, more of a tailored fit. Um, think of it more of like a cropped, like tailored pant, if you, if you will. But these are from Acne Studios. Um, actually a very, very good find because they were pretty cheap. They were maybe like 30 bucks on the real world too, but 
they fit pretty good they're a little bit big in the waist for me but they're kind of their cool look definitely cool girl look very versatile can style it any type of way you want um one thing about shopping on the railroad it's not really something you can like go and get multiples of so like if you like something from this haul you probably won't be able to like find it again unfortunately but at least gives you some ideas and maybe like where to look for some unique pieces definitely check it out and now on to tops so one top that i got that i like is this this um alexander wang and adidas collab um sweatshirt and it has a cool graphic on the back as well i just really like it um not too much to say about it but it's just really comfy nice oversized look um goes with a lot of stuff in my closet i actually have some helmet laying sweats that match perfectly to these this gray color so it's really um good pickup for me and i just love it it's just like the perfect throw-on sweatshirt for like anything so great Next, we have a very, very recent pickup, but, um, well, this is technically not a 22, 2022 pickup, but it's something that I wanted back in 2022, and I just found it, like, very recently, but I'm gonna count it because it's, I just couldn't find it, so. Um, that is this very colorful, fun sweater. So I really wanted a, um, like colorful cardigan is something fun because I really wear a lot of I don't know if you could tell from like the things I've shown but I wear a lot of neutrals a lot of blacks grays beiges and I was like I need some more color in my life you know I'm wearing a colorful sweater today but I really like wanted to do some you know more fun stuff so I was on the lookout for a colorful cardigan if I can find some examples I'll show you on the side here but um I didn't have any luck unfortunately but a couple weeks ago I got this sweater and it was perfect and I was like okay it has like a lot of you know colors in it but still like could match with some of my neutral pants um and like a different color on the back so very unique and I thought it was cool and um this is actually from Urban Outfitters but I got it from Nordstrom Rack but definitely have some good stuff super cute um last time I wore it I did get some compliments on it it's different for me because it's pretty big it's very oversized and again lots of colors in it so you know out of my comfort zone a bit but i think it's pretty cool and it's cute and really warm too so a win all around so now we're gonna go to the shoes we're gonna start with um sandals and um like slides type of thing and then sneakers and like boots I'm not sure if you guys are gonna be familiar with these, but these are the Camper Cobara heels, I believe is how you pronounce it. Um, I really, really wanted these for a long time, and I wanted them in yellow, but I didn't. I could never find them in yellow, and I found them on Depop for like twice the price for the yellow ones, so I just was like, no, I'm just gonna get white. So I got these off the website. Um, not too expensive either, maybe like $120 or something, but. Um, really really cute very unique shoe um they do run a little small so that was kind of that kind of sucked um for me so i haven't worn them like that much but i just love the way they look they're very cute and like they would be comfortable if they like fit they're like kind of tight in the like toe box area so um if, I, if you get these i recommend maybe sizing up a half size or um even a full size up but they do come with these removable I don't know, they're like velcro in these are movable soles yeah <laughs> they uh pop out so that might make a little bit of room for you if you like really really need it but i probably suggest you wear the soles because it's just velcro on the bottom but um they also come with the extra pair of soles so that's good but yeah definitely a good pickup um I wish they fit better, but I was still gonna rock it out. I mean, I've definitely bought plenty of shoes that were a little too small for me this year, um, but that's fine. <laughs> so um, we're gonna make it work, but they're also like plastic, like it's not rubber. It's, well, it might be rubber, but it's like, definitely a very plasticky shoe. So it's not, not a lot of give in it. So you might be able to break it in, not 100% sure, but just size up to be safe if you ever get them. But love these. Okay, next are these um pair of suey cokes i don't remember the um 
style name of these, but they're like the tabby um, cut like sandal, and I just thought these were pretty cool. Um, I've been really into tabby lately, as you will probably see again. Um, I did pick up some more like tabby shoes, but I'm not putting them in this haul because they're just like some Nike Airifs, but really cute. Um, very, very, very comfortable. Um, I got their true to size, so I got my actual size, but I set these on all the time, running errands, or even trying to get a fit off. Like, they're really good for either work because they're super comfortable and unique as well. So, if you like a good tabby shoe that's not like a marginal, then you know, there you go. And I got stuff for Rebel as well. And they actually got them pretty brand new. Like, they I've worn them already, so there's like a little bit of stuff at the bottom, but these are brand new when I got them. So you can get some brand new stuff off of the real one as well if you, you know, you dig and find. <laughs> so yeah. So here are another pair of sandals I got. Um, these are some Sui Cook slash Marseille, I guess is how you say the name. Marseille, Marseille. Um, these sandals. Um, super cute, kind of like dad sandal. Sorry, they're a little, a little dirty, don't mind them. Um, but yeah, there are some very cute, very comfortable, like dad sandals. Um, really, really nice quality. Like, this is all like leather um, here, and then leather sole, like kind of like a foam bottom, and then they have this nice, like, metal emblem right here. You can see that. So, yeah, these are really cute. Um, I'm really into like big shoes, like, if you can't tell. Like I really like a big oversized shoe. <laughs> so um, yeah, anything like fat and like low key ugly, I, I kind of like. So that's that's that on that. But those were cool pick up as well. Okay, so now for sneakers, I picked up these bad boys. Um, this Balenciaga track shoes um, i think these were the first edition so um gosh sorry for the light it's like super bright put them back here yeah so i got these like off-white um balenciaga track shoes these were another one that were a little too small because i got a size 37 and i realized i'm a 38 um after buying many 37s um throughout the year but it's okay just take the sole out of them wear some thin socks it's fine but I really like these. Um, I really wanted a off-white shoe, a chunky shoe, and um, this is before the Balenciaga scandal, so like, don't come for me. But <laughs> um, yeah, it's still pretty cool. I like them. So yeah, um, I'm sure you probably know what these are. I'm sure you've seen them before. Nothing new to see, but definitely a good find because they were really, really cheap as well in comparison to like a brand new pair. So again. I wish this was sponsored. It's not a sponsored real world video. Obviously, I don't have enough subscribers for sponsorships yet, but soon come. Hopefully, I'm gonna put that to existence and hopefully, I will get a real world sponsorship soon because I love them, obviously. So, moving on. So, next pair of sneakers are these. Ah, love these. I got these at Second Street in LA to LA so if you if you saw the last vlog it's already up you saw when I picked these up but um these I wanted these for such a long time these are the um Joe Fresh Goods there it is the Joe Fresh Goods pair um these are like one of the first ones that came out um a couple years ago and like I really really wanted them when they first came out and they're like four hundred dollars or something but um at least they were like on go for in my size but they i got them for me like two something at second street and they were brand new um i've worn them a couple times so they're a little dirty now but they were like brand spanking new when i picked them up so love these um also a little too small a little small but it's okay we um took the soles out again then socks make it work but yeah very cute another colorful thing I added to my closet this year so I'm really trying to venture out into color and not be so beige and gray and black and dreary we're gonna really do the colors and this summer I'm gonna be popping you will see all the color this year and then if you watch the other like my one of my first vlogs you saw when I got these these Dior um they're called the D-Connect sneaker so 
I actually picked these up at um, the thrift store here in Atlanta, um, Ragarama. And I got these for like $30, like almost brand new. Like the sole isn't even worn or anything. Like, and they're like, they're like pretty cute. Like I've, I haven't seen these before, um, like before I bought them, but like they're a really good pickup. And I was just like, for 30 bucks, I could do that. So yeah, they're a great color. I haven't worn them like a lot. I think I've worn them a couple times. But um, they're definitely versatile. Definitely got lots of my closet. Love green, love uh, like a nice army green. So great pickup, especially for the price. So yeah, um, I think I've seen these on the real world as well before. So if you like these, um, then you can definitely get them secondhand somewhere. Um, probably for relatively cheap. Good find your Deconnect sticker. So next is gonna be boots and heels and no pair of slides. So one more thing. <laughs> so I got a pair of Bottegas as well. So I got some Bottega uh, Veneta boots. Um, super, super cute. Very, very grown, very sexy shoe for me. I do not wear heels. You see, I didn't really pick up a lot of heels this year because I don't wear them. But I like figured I needed a good pair of heels, something that I can throw on if I'm like trying to, you know, step up my fit a little bit or just trying to be like, I don't know, out here, you know, sophisticated. This is my sophisticated shoe of the year. So I really, really like these. Um, they're not the most comfortable, but I mean, of course, it's a heel. But it's not a bad heel. It's kind of short, so, you know, we can still get around. We can still do what we need to do. But a very, very cool design. Um, weren't that expensive. I mean, they weren't thousands of dollars. I got these off the real as well. There's a theme. <laughs> um, but, yeah, super, super cute. Very, very... Um, I don't want to be comfortable, but they're not bad. They're not They're not bad to wear. I got to put in some, probably like a gel insole or something, just to make sure, it, you know, I can kind of stand up throughout the night. But they're a very, very good pickup. Um, really, really cute on the feet. I'm going to, hopefully you're seeing on the side, like how they look on, how they look with, like cargos, um, straight leg pant or anything like that. But they're like really cute, kind of like peeking out of a pair of pants. You, know, you don't really know what's going on, but you see something that's a little different. So yeah, I really like these, especially for the tips, because I was planning to wear them with more like a baggy pant kind of look. So that was the vision. But yes, love these shoes. My first kind of like big girl purchase, designer shoe purchase. So yes, welcome to the club. I'm welcoming myself to the club. Then we have these are actually a gift, but I really, really want these so bad. So, thanks, baby, for doing this for me for Christmas. But look! A genuine, genuine Mason Margiela tabby shoe. Oh, uh, they're so beautiful. Um, white, they have like the kind of like crinkly texture on them and like this like cork heel. So very cute, very unique. Um, really, really like these a lot. They're a beautiful shoe. Wanted them, and they're actually very, very comfortable. So um, if you're into tabby um, shoes, if you're into Margiela's, um, a great pickup for sure. Can never go wrong with that. So love that for us. Okay. So my favorite and final thing in this haul. And I just got, so I was waiting to make this video. That's why it's coming out a little later than I wanted because I was waiting to get this in the mail. And it finally came in. Oh, you can see it. Togas. I got a pair of togas, but not just any. Not just any togas, okay? They are the toga pull-up, but I got the cream color and I love them I love these so much I actually wore them today out so I'm unboxing them like they're new they're they're new but I've already worn them twice but I I mean come on like come on look at that like they're so cute and they're really they're they're okay 
as far as comfortability goes, like I think I might put another insole in them because I'm just flat footed, so things tend to like hurt my feet anyway. But they um, are really comfortable, especially with socks, and they're super versatile, but definitely like a statement shoe. So if you're wearing these, people are probably gonna ask what they are, you know. But like I've seen these so much, and I used to see them in black, so when I saw this color, I was like, okay, yeah, I gotta have it. Because I didn't want the black ones, so I'm like, the black ones look very, they can be kind of like, like, like a little gothic, like a little like intense. And I think they're still really nice, but as far as like my style and you know, I felt like the cream color probably worked a little bit better in my closet. So I really, 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 really like these a lot. Um, they go with so much stuff. You can kind of dress them up, dress them down, or just if you have a chill outfit, these are definitely gonna elevate your outfit. I really, really love these. Tuga Pull is um, definitely my favorite cop of 2022 i purchased them in 2022 they got here in 2023 but that's okay um definitely gonna rock them forever um great pickup got them on the essence sale so um not full price still pricey but definitely worth it um yeah <laughs> awesome find love these so so much definitely like me in a shoe for sure um yeah Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. This is definitely um, a different video than what I normally post. So um, hopefully we'll be bringing more things besides just vlogs. I want to do, you know, fashion stuff and some art stuff too. Um, some of you may or may not know, but I do like to art. Um, to art. I like to paint and draw and all the other type of stuff. So I'm going to be sharing that as well. So um Thank you so much for watching today's video. Um, I hope that you found some things you like and if the things you don't like, I don't want to know about it because I like it, so I don't care. <laughs> but um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for sticking with me. Hopefully there'll be some more content and videos coming soon. Um, different type of videos, not just vlogs again, but all type of stuff. Getting to know me, getting to know everything. Um, so yeah, thank you so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.